Brewers cards over here with another baseball cards on a budget. And uh, I've seen a couple other uh, rippers do this or breakers do this where they take three products here from 2020 and let's, you know, see which one is best. So we're going to, we got one box here of 2020 Heritage, 2020 Donruss, and then 2020 uh, Top Series 1. Uh, reason I picked these three is because I'm trying to collect each one of these sets. So it actually, you know, fits with the whole budget theme. I'm actually doing something, not just looking for the best cards. In this case, we are going to look for the best cards, but we're also trying to help uh, compile the sets that I'm putting together. So this isn't like a total uh, reach or waste of money or anything else like that. Uh, and we've gone with a little more tropical theme, seeing that we've got our plant going on over here along with everything else. So Anyway, we're going to get started, and well, we also got the trusty 8-ball to see if we got any hits, see if you could call that for us. I think we're going to start, we're just going to go in chronological order. Uh, top Series 1 came out first, so we're going to grab Top Series 1 and uh, see what it has to offer. Ooh, let's shake the 8-ball. Hey, you, what do you think? You think we got a hit here in the Top Series 1 baseball box? And it says, get out of here. So... What does that mean? Does that mean get out of here as in yes, we have some, or get out of here as in there's no way. Get out of here. Forget about it. So, all right. Let's take a look. Let's get this open. That would be helpful. Oh, yeah. This is going to be difficult. Give me just a second here. All right. Right on the front, look at that, Aaron Judge. Not too bad, not too bad. All right, so, first we'll start off by putting the Aaron Judge aside, because that's good, it looks like it could be a good card. We got Candelario, we got Brendan McKay. All right, let's just go through here. Any good rookies or anything else? Alex Verdugo, we got a Guerrero Jr. card. We'll set that one aside. Marte, oops, I'm just going to throw... Oh, I'm just going to throw Chris Paddock around. I don't know if that'll necessarily be one of the best cards. Speaking of best cards, let's go here and flip these. Oh, I will just... Well, no, we'll just continue on with this theory here. Flip those to the back. There we go. And we'll put these over here. Jorge Polanca, Domingo Santana, former brewer. Ivan Liguria, not Eva Liguria, the hot chick. Uh, ooh, Christian Yelich. Nice. I'll put that over there just as a possible. Oh, wait a minute. Is this the actual card or is this a short print? I want to say it's a short print, but I can't read it right now. So, let me put that aside. We'll take a look here in a minute. Johnny Cueto, Indians, Athletics, Robbie Grossman, Jalen Davis, that guy, Andrew Miller, Nick Pavetta, Derek Dietrich, Matt Strom, Nolan Arenado, Savali, got Justin Verlander, Aristides Aquino, very nice. That will definitely go over in the pile of potentially good stuff. Luis Garcia, Austin Riley, Christian Yelich, that's more of a personal thing, but we'll still put them over there because I like that. J.P. Crawford, Kevin Pillar, Kyle Lewis, Bubba Starling, J.D. Martinez, Brad Keller, Ian Kennedy, Max Kepler, Tommy Pham, Anthony Rendon, Andrew Chafin, Chafin what? Jorge Soler, Anthony Rendon, Steven Strasberger, Mitch Hanniger, Michael Chavis, Brian Anderson, Mike Boustakis, no longer a brewer, but it is a brewer card. Max Stassi, <clears throat> excuse me, Adrian Morjan, rookie card. 
We've got a Daniel Polka and Kenza Dunn. Okay, and then we got the Gold Sandy Alcantara. Then we've got Reese Hoskin insert. Got a Warren Spawn, which I like, and then Chris Paddock 1985 insert. Chris Sale. Jake Rogers, Brendan Rogers, Brendan Rogers, Kristen Yelich, and a Chris Davis. All right. So for me, I'm going to rate this between cards that I actually want and cards that are actually worth something. And I think we'll just go top three. So we got Yelich, Turkey Red, I think is probably... And then the 2020 with that gold card. And the Aquino. I mean, we got a couple other good cards in there. And we can throw that into the overall value maybe. But as far as cards that I want or cards that have some value, probably going to be the Yelich, the Alcantara, and the Aquino. So there we go for that. Now, second on the agenda, or second on the release, was the Heritage 2020. Now, I don't have a whole lot of hope for this box, just because the inserts in this are seemingly pretty weak, at least the ones that I've pulled so far out of this. I've gotten closer and closer to a set, but uh, except for the high, high numbers, the short prints, <clears throat> and have gotten almost nothing as far as action variation. The only one I got was a Shohei Otani. So, overall, this set, although it's a beautiful set, I love 1971 Topps Baseball, and I love the look of them and everything, I just feel like dollar for dollar, pound for pound, really haven't got what, uh, what you'd expect to get out of a Heritage release. So, let's take a look. We got Josh Naylor, we got World Series Championship, Adam Frazier, Jarlid Garcia, Scott Kingery, Nick Whitgren, we got Jose Quintana, Chris Davis, Domingo Santana, former brewer, Freddie Freeman, Gio Urshela, Anthony Rizzo, Ryan Braun, current brewer, very nice. Brandon Nemo, Mike Soroka, and I'm guessing that might be... No, I'm not right there. Actually, I haven't checked any of these so far. Hold on. Let's take a look and see if maybe we got a, a OPG back or a high number. I should be checking these as we go, but no, I did not. But so far, no good. All right, so so far, none of that. All right, there we go. Michael Conforto, Ben Gamble, Brewer, Mike Trout. Mike Trout's got to go into the good stuff. Now let's check. I think Mike Trout might even be, yep. That is a high number besides being Mike Trout. Then we got the Willie Mays. Then we got Carlos Carrasco. And we got Jeff Zamarja. And we got Yuri Gurriel. And Sean Murphy. Looks like he wanted to close his eyes on. Oops. Whoa, I'm way out of camera there. Looks like he wanted to close his eyes on that one. And Taylor Naquin. And Game 12. Williams Astadio. We've got a Alberto Mondesi. We've got. That game, we got Freddie Peralta, which is a brewer. We'll put him over there. Justin Upton, Eric Feedy, and oop, I flipped Ozzy Albies. Ozzy Albies, Ronald Guzman, John Means, and Austin Slater. Now. <laughs> I only set a few cards, so set aside a few cards. I guess I'm going, well, anyway. These, the Trout, probably the worth the most being high series, short print. I'll just kind of push Gamble off to the side, even though I'll 
pull them out again later. But again, didn't expect much out of Heritage, and well, what do you know? Got what we expected, which was not much. All right, so last box of 2020 Don Rush <clears throat> pad. If you watched uh, my last, I'm sorry, lunchtime rips. There we go. I got a tremendous set of cards out of lunchtime rips from Dodd Rush 2020. So, kind of high expectations for me on this one. Excited to get this one open and see what we got. Again, I'm going to guess that we're going to get not quite the same level of cards that we got in the other box. But, uh, here's hoping for the best. Ironic. Here, look at that. Aaron Judge on the front again. So we got two different packs, two different makers, and got an Aaron Judge on the cover. So kind of got to like that a little bit. All right, let's go. Aaron Judge. Very nice. Yet a year Molina. Now, the other thing that I found when I was opening up those Don Russ that I didn't realize is that some of these have a variation of the city on the back. And we'll take a look for those. Gold, Paul Goldschmidt. Aroldis Chapman. And it's really easy to determine that. I'll show you how if we come across one. Kyle Hendricks. Max Muncy. Elvis Andrews. Please get around. Jose Ramirez. Michael Brantley. Gary Sanchez. Uh, Hunter Renfro. Chris Davis, Yoan Mancada, pill sticker. Yeah, I don't know. All right, Matt Olson. This one's flipped around. Jordan Yamamoto, Lucas Giolito, another Paul Goldschmidt. Yeah, there we go. This one is. This one's different, but what's different about it? Okay, you see up here? This up here is a different symbol. Then go back, go back, go back. Actually, didn't we get another Goldschmidt in here? Yeah. Then this Paul Goldschmidt. You see that one's different up in that corner. Why is that one different? They're the same card number. And everything else, the wording seems to be the same. Cities are the same. Ah, it's a different card. I mean, it's the same card over and everything. It's just a different photo. So it's a photo variation on that one. And this little symbol up here points that one out. That is a photo variation of Paul Goldschmidt. Sweet. I did not know about photo variations either. Interesting. <clears throat> All right. Let's continue on. Bo Bichette, rookie. Okay, so that goes into the definitely... Uh, a good card type deal. So we're going to put Goldschmidt photo variation up there as well. Boba shut. And then we got a Vladdy Jr. Uh, Diamond King, sorry. Uh, Anthony Rizzo. Uh, he's also different. Chai Town. Okay, so that is the town variation there. Zach Gallon. And it doesn't look like there's anything different about Zach Gallon there. Fernando Tatis Jr., Kirby Puckett. Then we got an El Mago, Javi Baez, name variation. Kyle Lewis, rated rookie. Shane Bieber, Diamond King. Shohei Otani, also a variation, must be an action variation. Uh, I'm guessing he was batting in the other card. And he's pitching on this card would be my guess. Because there's no name variation there, but interesting. Matt Carpenter, Baby Shark. I pulled a Nolan Ryan Baby Shark the other day. That was pretty cool. Uh, Jose Abreu, Orange. Eric Hosmer. And I also, they have variations on these too. So I'll have to watch out for that. Eric Hosmer. Ricky Henderson. Very nice, Ricky Henderson. I like that. Matt Carpenter. 
Shane Bieber, and Shohei Otani. Again, with that, I wonder, I'm going to have to see if I have a, what the regular Shohei Otani is, but that is definitely the variation, so very cool. Then we got a Brenda McKay Rookies, not numbered. Aristido Aquino, very nice. Very, very nice. Highlights. <clears throat> David Peralta. Giancarlo Stanton. Yusei Kukuchi, of course, again, this would not be a Brewer's card forever opening without a Yusei Kukuchi. It seems like we get them all the flipping time. <clears throat> Brandon Crawford. Wilson Contreras. Matt Carpenter. Eduardo Escobar, and then Domingo Liva, Roger Clemens, I like Roger Clemens, most people don't for, you know, the whole PED thing, but before he ever did PEDs, he was still, uh, he was still a Hall of Famer before it, all that started, so, anyway, Alan Trammell, Brandon Noose, Eddie Murray, Hall of Famer, Logan Allen, and last but not least, Danny Mendick. All right. <clears throat> well, just by the sheer amount of cards that I got out of that, including this Aquino, the Shohei variations, the Baby Shark, Matt Carpenter, even though he's a Cardinal, we got to respect the Baby Shark. And the name variation, even though he's Javi Baez of the Cubs. We're still that's still a good card. City variation on Rizzo, another Cub. The Vladdy, the Goldschmidt variation, and the Bobachet. So Don Russ definitely wins this one. We totally forgot to use the ball, but that's okay because there were no hits in the um heritage and the Don Ross well we kind of knew what was coming or at least we hoped we knew what was coming all right so uh, obviously Don Ross wins and I hope you liked what you saw here today if you liked what you saw go over here and give me a like and last time I looked I'm at 207 for subscription or subscriptions yes not prescriptions this isn't Walgreens uh go over here and give me a subscription let me know what you thought about this and uh, leave me some comments down below uh, what do you think of this year's cards, or what do you think of this, uh, the way I did this, or anything else? And uh, you go out there, be safe, or don't go out there, stay at home, don't go out there, be safe, uh, and we will see you the next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.